Okay, in case you guys haven't seen it, Rocket League just released a brand new update that actually shows your match history in-game. So, you can see 2 minutes 20 seconds ago, and 8 minutes 36 seconds ago. Yep, I played two games, I lost both of them. Those were supposed to be the first two matches of this video, but that's neither here nor there, that's in the past! All right, and then you can see all the other matches you've played, uh, which is the last 20 online matches from the last 30 days. Uh, you can also see all the saved replays, so they have a new little replay UI here. Uh, so it's basically the same exact uh, functionality, but it kind of gives you the stats, which is nice. So if you click on a random replay, you can see, oh, I got three goals, zero saves, one assist, seven shots, this much score, blah, blah, blah. So it's pretty nice. And then also, in addition to that, in addition to that, on Rocket League's website, you can actually log in and see your profile. So you can see when you uh, were established, what your current XP level is. You can see all of your career stats. Uh, although, I need to refresh my page. There you go. You can see all your career shots, goals, saves, assists, MVPs, wins, linked accounts. You can see uh, for the current Season 16, you can see the overview of your Rocket Pass level, all the matches played, you know, all of your certain ranks. And you can also see your match history from here. And you can also see everything from the previous season. So, I think this is a really good change. I'm really happy with the way that it looks, the way that it functions in-game. And let me know what you guys think in the comments. But anyways, we're gonna get right into game number one, and I'll see you all then. Okay, game number one. In case you guys are wondering why I don't have a face cam, basically it's 10.30 at night, and I wanted to record this video so I could get it out for tomorrow, because the update just released at 7 p.m. today, and basically synced since, oh, that's bad for me. I should have definitely had the, the save there. I could have moved up as soon as he jumped the first time. I kind of just didn't. But the update has been live since about 7 p.m. But I've been hosting my older brother and his fiance at my apartment since 6 p.m. So obviously can't really record the video while they're here. We were playing some Catan. Played two games. I lost both of them. I'm very sad. Uh, and now I get to play some ranked and tilt to this instead. You know, instead of tilting at... All the wood and the sheep and the brick that my brother is getting and that I'm not, I get to tilt to losing rank twos. So, let's do it. Uh, I also just didn't feel like turning on my lights. It, I, I've kind of had like a headache slash migraine-ish feeling the whole day. Uh, pretty much since like noon. So, definitely did not think it was a good idea to turn on my bright studio lights in order to have the face cam in there. And I know you guys would say, oh, well just don't turn on the lights. No, then the, the camera settings are specifically, um, help. The camera settings are specifically set up for working with those bright lights. So if I wanted to have any sort of picture quality that's somewhat decent with the camera, I would need to like adjust things. And I don't want to adjust things. So sorry for the no face cam this video, but actually some people might prefer it. So. All right, good little breezy there. Wait on him. Okay, I'll get back here. He can take this. I'll wait for the touch over him. That guy got a triple reset. Okay, he's got a reset as well. Nice. Good save. I'm trying to just stay on this. Nice. Should be free ball for him. Nice. Good clear. I'm going to try to just grab some pads here. Get over the one guy. I'm trying to just go for a demo on this guy because I think my teammate's gonna have a better angle to shoot that from. All right. Unfortunately, he's gonna have that. I'll try to go for a challenge here. Make sure to hit the ball. You know, make sure to get enough height that I can try to go high uh, if he keeps on touching the ball up. But if he touches the ball down, I do want to be able to adjust. Oh, he went low. He faked me like he was close. Um, I knew that I could beat him there, but he jumped in such a way that it really did look like he was going to hit the ball high and like he was ready to shoot it. Now, I didn't think he was. Like, I thought I positioned myself properly, but turns out, obviously, he wasn't. Oh, no! I wish I could have done... Oh, sorry. My bad, Hudev. Hopefully, he can uh, get a good touch there. That's a good dunk. Very risky play and kind of stupid, but it works. I'm not upset that I did that. Okay. Ball's gonna go up there. Nice. Hit that out. Maybe he can go. Shot. Bang! Ah, oh, close. Yeah, I'll play behind him now. Maybe hit it mid. I gotta wait on the touch. Ah, I'm dead. Okay. That's fine. 
Wait on Kipper. He's gonna maybe get a flick here. Nice, good touch from Hudev. Get one more. I'm gonna play the miss here. Absolutely no respect at all, and I still miss the shot. That's very unfortunate. This proto guy has not a lot of boost here. Now he has boost. Uh, I bumped him though, so he can't get a touch. Now Hudev's got a little bit of a solo play. Oh my god. There's been so many like flip resets this game and failed flip resets. It's actually hilarious. I bumped him. I'm gonna fake this first. Take a 50. Nice. Now he can take a 50 if he wants. That's gonna be in our net. <laughs> That's not the. No! Oh, I don't think. I think me front flipping is what actually got the demo there. So I think even if I didn't front flip, um, the ball was probably still going in anyways. But that's really sad to actually end up getting the demo and then being the final touch that puts the ball in the net. Dude. Oh, I hate this game sometimes. I swear. I swear. And I'm saying that with a smile on my face right now. Uh, well, it's gone. But it was there when I said I hate this game sometimes. And I'm just, I'm really sad. I mean, first goal, probably my fault, but also just like a bad kickoff, like cheat, where I was left in a 1v1 with the other guy. Second goal. Probably my fault. Third goal, maybe not my fault. Fourth goal, maybe not my fault. Ah, it sucks, man. We'll go right into game number two. I'll see you all then. To be honest, man, I just want to get through this recording without losing every single game. Like, I would just love to win this game. And we got our same teammate from last game, of course, because, you know, when you lose with a teammate, whether or not it's their fault, you're going to get them again. Because Rocket League loves just comeback stories, I guess. And, okay. Just score this. Let's just let's just become RLCS pros for this game, Hudev. Let's just me and you pretend, and that's that's a great start. Let's just me and you pretend like we're RLCS pros, and we can actually hit cool things. All right, I'm gonna do my best impression. You do your best impression. I'm gonna lock the F, the mother F in, and I'm not gonna get spun out on basic bump plays. Oh wow, we actually covered the high. Good play from Woody there. Oh wow, this guy took my boost. Shot? Oh, close. Good shot attempt. I think I'll be able to beat him here, but I'll just actually fake that. Nice, that's a good clear. I was really hoping that I would catch him like flipping forward and it would just go straight in the net, but that didn't end up happening. Okay, watch for the touch. I hit that over him. Ooh, that's not great. Hadev? Okay, nice. Thank you. Kind of bailed me out there. I'm not doing a good RLCS player impression right now, so let me just wait. Let me uh, get behind him here. Nice, he's got that. I'll just sit behind him now. I really can't follow that ball up there. Nice, I'll get a soft touch. He can go for that. I need him to get back though. I bought him as much time as I could with that air dribble and getting a flip reset that actually went up rather than just on the net. And... Yeah, I needed him to get back to me, though. Okay, I do have to go up for that ball. Just trying to keep it high. Pipcox might be able to go for that, but I'll just get behind him in case he gets dunked. Wait on this. Nice. Just hit that to the corner where it's safe. Hudev does get the boost, but unfortunately gets also demoed. Oh, please go. Nice. Nice. Good save from him. Good save from me as well. You know, hard to read that play specifically. Oh, shoot. Uh, I can stay on this. Flick. Gotta get a demo on Woody. Yeah, unfortunately a little bit too hard of a flick. Uh, that's the power of the Dominus right there. Nice. Good shot. Unfortunately he's gonna have that. Should be fine though. Hadev gets a solo play opportunity off of it. VIP Cucks actually just jumped. Nice, nice, good saves. Nice, good touch under. He might be able to score that. Nice, nice, good job. Good job, good save from us. I saw him going to the ceiling, and even though that is a good play, it does really give you only one option to get to the ball, especially if you use all of your boost to get up to the ceiling. You know, it's very, very readable kind of where the ball is going after you're already on the ceiling, because all you can do is go down from the ceiling and hit the ball towards the goal. There's not really much room for going, you know, off the ceiling and then going under the ball for a double tap or whatever. Especially if you don't get to the ceiling in the most efficient way possible while also having 100 boost to start the aerial. 
which a lot of the people at this rank are not uh, efficient enough at yet. Sorry. Kind of a bad 50 from me. Kind of a bad recovery from, from him to use all of his boost there and then not be back in net. But it's uh, fault on both ways, so. No. I'll wait on this. I'll take the ball. What he's going for a 50, that's fine. Try to go up for this, nice. I am gonna use my boost to get down here. Oh, that's not good. Shouldn't have used my boost to get down there uh, if it's not gonna make a difference with whether or not I can pressure the play. Okay, it's fine. No big deal there, he's gonna hit the ball up. I'm just gonna go for this. He can hit it over me, but Hudev should be there. You know, the only real threat there is him getting a flip reset. And he obviously did not do that. I'm gonna shoot that ball, and, and by shoot it, I mean butcher it entirely. But I'll wait on him. Nice. Wait on the touch. Ooh, that's in the net. And that's an own goal. Fudge. Nuggets. Sorry. Uh, I should have had that save from before the ball even hit the inside of the post there. That's, that's my bad. Obviously, I didn't know that that ball wasn't going in the net. Like, I didn't miss that save intentionally because I knew the shot was off. Um, I think any professional coach is going to tell you to, to save that shot. Oh my god. Even, I think, if people knew that that shot was off, I, I think they're still going to tell you to go for it. Nice save from Hadev. I don't know if I'll be able to really help him here. I'll be on the ground, though. Okay, we're just own goaling. <laughs> <laughs> That's like the third time we've nearly own gold the ball. Nice. I have no boost, though. Okay, they kind of pinched with each other, or at least 50 each other. But he's going to have a touch here. Okay. Open? No. Not quite open. I'm going to wait on him. Play this touch here. I got it. Oh, shoot. Sorry. I'm gonna get a demo on Woody, maybe. Nice. I do hit around them, but the ball's gonna go out and up. So, not really a ball that my teammate can challenge. I'm gonna hit this ball back. Should be pretty fine there. Nice. We're just gonna hit it down. Alright. Hopefully, we get a good kickoff. Gonna watch out for the Spanish. Nice. Okay. Good follow up from him. Maybe able to get another touch on the ball there. He does get bumped, so I'm in a little bit of a 1v2. But they're not going to be able to do anything with that based on where Woody touched the ball. Okay. That should be fine as well. Woody's kind of overcommitted here. He doesn't have a lot of boost. He has possession. My teammate has possession of the ball. So, got to wait on this, though. He's a lot closer than I am. Okay, I can just hit that over to the corner. I don't want to try to stay with it because it's a lot easier for my teammate to just stay with the ball there. And this guy's going to have it. Take the touch here. All right. He's going to be there. Hadev can go for that. I'll wait behind him here. Full boost. Just playing behind. Good flip over him. And... No! What? What, dude? Are these guys like the best defenders of all time? Okay, can he go for that? I think, right? No. But that should be free. How did that ball go up? I honestly, I thought I 50 that ball or like at least covered every single angle there. That, that was unexpected entirely. I'm gonna leave that for him. He might be able to just shoot that. Okay, I'll put on Woody. Okay. Nice. Good save from HUD Ev. Oh, this is not gonna be good. Nice, good save. HUD Ev can stay on that. He should be able to get that. Nice, good save. And maybe just stay on it, try to get a 50. That's a good 50. I'll see if he gets that mid boost. He's not going to. So I did leave the corner. They do bump each other off of that, and I shoot it in the net. Nice. Perfect. Let's go. All right, we'll get right into game number three, and I'll see you all then. Okay, game number three. We got Instinct on our team, playing against Bax and HUD-EV. 
Uh, so the guy we had on our team, of course, as soon as we win with him, not that it was a very convincing win or anything like that, but as soon as we win with him, we are now no longer on his team. That's my bad. I missed that mid boost there. And if I had gotten that mid boost, would have been much, much easier. I also got a bad kickoff there. Like, just did not hit the ball centrally at all. And it made the kickoff extremely, extremely unpredictable and hard for him to follow up. And honestly, hard for me to read, like, where that was going. Nice. Good touch there. Looks like they're turning on the ball, but I noticed I could pretty easily get a demo there. Good reset from Instinct. I'm going to try to just get in position to cover this. Nice. Good touch up there. If I'd landed on the wall, that would have been perfect. Uh, unfortunately, obviously did get demoed. Hey, good 50. He should be able to turn on that. Maybe. Yep. Oh, that's a good pass. I don't know if that was intentional or not, but and I'm demoed again. Okay. All right. We're going to do a little bit of a reset here. Uh, Hudev going to have that ball. Okay, I'm going to wait on instinct. And I'm dead again. Okay. I mean, that that time I kind of put myself in a spot where I could easily get demoed. But. Nice. Good touch over the two of them. Maybe? No. Okay. That was a good little wave dash into touch there. You know, the idea being just catch them off guard. They're not going to expect you to land that fast. I'm dead again, aren't I? Yeah. Okay. Kind of turned into that one, too. I, I don't know. I think, bro. Okay, nah. At this point, at this point, it's intentional. At this point, it's a hate crime. I think. I think these guys just hate Dominus. Uh, but at least Instinct loves scoring open nets. And by open, I mean he took it like that was that was really really good. It's a good play. I'll cheat up here. Nice. Bump him onto the boost. Now I'm gonna go back and get our own boost. And now he should be able to. Ooh, close. That in my net. Can I get back to that? Nice. Instinct might be able to solo that? Ugh. You can tell when my mechanics aren't really feeling the best when I start doing terrible flips like that. Where that, that happens when I try to like kind of rush my speed flip. And I do... I end up backflipping before I even do the front flip. That's when you can really tell that my mechanics are, are not feeling on. And obviously right now, you know, it's late and I haven't really warmed up too much. I pretty much just got done with, you know, hosting my brother and uh, company. And uh, just hopped in immediately to try and record this video before it got too late. Okay, try to get it over. Maybe just in the net. Nice. Wow, good save for my teammate. Well, good save for my former teammate. Musty? Oh, not enough power there. I was trying to, you know, kind of catch them off guard by going for a Musty pass instead of a regular one. The idea being, okay, they kind of hesitate in their mind for a second and think, oh, wow, the, you know, the, the guy is basically tilting his nose down. He must be going to the ground with it. Maybe I should hit the brakes and get towards the ground, right? And then obviously pull out the musty, a lot more power than they're expecting. I'm gonna flip that over the one guy. Hud Ev can get a touch, but he doesn't have boost because I know that Instinct just stole it. Shoot a top right, beautiful shot. Great pass. Great pass, nice shot, beautiful placement, beautiful power, uh, amazing plays. All right, they go for a fake kickoff, that's fine. Instinct, gonna get that boost and immediately just challenge. Is that gonna be a free double? Close. I'll just dribble this over. Just dribble that in. Oh no. Uh, Bax gets the flick. Not able to get this touch. I'll be able to go for it. Oh, sorry. I thought I could get that ball. I don't know how. I don't know how that ball got past me. Uh, I didn't think he would be able to hit it out that much. Oh, don't tell me. Oh, I'm sorry, Instinct. I had a bad kickoff. I had a really bad kickoff. That happened both times this game on those diagonal kickoffs there. I just had a really bad diagonal. All right. 
I'll wait on their touch. And it's not in. Okay, that's fine. Play behind him now. Maybe he can force it. Okay. Nice. Good dive there. Didn't even know where he was, but I could kind of just tell from the positioning of the ball where I was going to need to be. Nice, good 50. Low boost there, and the other guy goes flying past. Now it should just be HUD Ev in the net that has boost. I don't think the other guy that was in there is going to have any, any boost at all in the tank. So I'll just wait on this touch, see if he goes for a double. Okay. That's the only shot I'm really worried about there is if I pre-jump the, the shot, trying to block it, and he goes for a double, it's pretty much just an easy win for him. So as long as I can avoid that, we're all right. I'm getting out now. Maybe instincts can go. I gotta wait on his touch. Ooh. Yeah, maybe I should have been there. I don't know. I feel like I'm not playing quick right now. And it's probably just because I'm tired. I, I don't want to keep on bringing that up. I don't want to keep on bringing up how late it is or how tired I am. But that's... I j just left the net open and we just lost a, a three goal lead. I mean, that's... Ooh, that's really bad for me. I, I, I played not how I wanted to. But you know what? This is real. This is, this is Jamaican Coconut, you know? Some games you're not always going to win. So I'm glad that we at least got the one win. But uh, that whole session for me, I, I lost four and I won one game. So, you know, I'll do anything for the YouTube recording. Uh, if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. See you on the next one. Peace.